Chris Sanders. Number 45, Adam Osborne. Number 45, Adam Osborne. Going to start the big boy tonight. And number 12, Michael Lane. So again, it's going to be John Chibro, Kevin Frierson, Michael Lane, Chris Sanders, and Adam Osborne for it. the Warriors. It'll be a different starting five than we saw at, at Riverdale. Well, glad they're not starting Bobby Leathers, who's always played good against the Blue Devils. But the Blue Devils, we're gonna, they're going to change their starting lineup as well. Malcolm Anir gets a starting starting nod tonight. Brent Clemens gets a starting nod tonight as Chad Lanning will not be starting. Daniel Easterly, Matt Vaughn, and also Reese Davis. So a little bit of a change in lineup for the Blue Devils as well as John Boyce and Chad Lanning are not getting the starting nod tonight as it's going to be Brent Clemens, Reese Davis, Daniel Easterly, Matt Vaughn, and Malcolm Anir for well, the Blues. Just, you said earlier that he was mixing that lineup up uh, instead of going with the two teams. Now we're going to see the mix change here, and, and uh, they're going to have everybody in there together. Pat, uh, Blue Devils, and just because Boyce and Lannon is not starting doesn't mean they're not going to get plenty of playing time. Well, they'll I'm probably sure they're going to be in there as much as anybody. Well, they'll fill in for that second group. I mean, they'll probably go with two groups here. They're early going anyway, Clyde, but it's just going to be a different group of personnel. So, Easterly and Osborne to jump it. It's in the air, and Easterly with a tap. Vaughn's got the ball in the backcourt, and the Blue Devils are on the attack. Malcolm Manier on the wing right, working to the basket to your right. Brings it out front to Vaughn. Vaughn, reverse dribble on Sanders. Goes to the far side, gets it to Clemens. Clemens down in a corner to Reese Davis. Davis spins, can't get the shot away. Gets it back to Clemens along the baseline, a running eight-footer. It's good, and Lebanon leads. Brent Clemens hit a little eight-foot runner on the baseline. Steal, but then they steal it back. Frierson takes it back away from Malcolm Manier. Down in the corner, they go to Cheese Brew. Kicks it outside. To Lane, a jumper from out front won't do, but it's tapped out of there, and Brent Clemens controls. Clemens to Vaughn, right side, Manier with a three there. Five nothing, and the Blue Devils jump out in a hurry. Well, big shots right there by Manier, pull up three pointer, he guns, and it's a five point cushion right off the bat. Cheese brew to Lane, hook pass across to Sanders, down underneath to Cheese brew, saved it on the baseline. Here's Frierson, and Easterly's on his back. And that's one of the things we cannot afford. Easterly gets in foul trouble against Oakland, and it really killed this ball club, Pat. Well, Clyde, that's not a very smart foul by Easterly. Is he could have just stood there, put pressure on big number Kever, big number 40, Kevin Frierson, without picking up the foul. But Easterly picks up his first. Frierson misses the free throw, but that's not the big story. The foul on Easterly is what we certainly don't need. Second throw, Frierson is good. And it's a 5-1 ball game. 6.53 to play in the opening quarter. Malcolm Manier dribbles it over the timeline, working against Frierson. Manier looks for somebody. He's got Vaughn out front. Vaughn looks back to Manier on the wing, goes at the free top of the key, tries to get into the free throw line. Frierson cuts him off, and he bring it to Vaughn, and they'll bring it outside and set it up again. Vaughn on the dribble, goes to the baseline. Banks it to Easterly. Fakes Easterly from eight. Count it. And it's a seven to one ball game. Good move, Daniel Easterly. A little pump fake, one dribble, pulls up and really got rid of the defender and buries that eight footer. Sanders throws it away. Malcolm Manier going to take it all the way down, lay it up, no good. Reese Davis follows. He's fouled. Let's see who they call it on. Caught on three. That's going to be Chris Sanders. Sanders got him on the arm, so. Reese Davis will go to the free throw line and shoot two for the Blue Devils. Number one's good, and it's an 8-1 ball game. Lebanon coming out of the shoot in a hurry here tonight, as did the Devilettes in the earlier game. Reese Davis, Lebanon senior, fires up number two. This one is no good. It's rebounded by Cheese Brew underneath. Kick out pass to Lane. Lane dribbles it over the timeline, working for Riverdale. Now to the basket to your left, cutting into the free throw line, bothered by Clemens. They go down low to Frierson, and it's slapped out of there by Reese Davis. Boy, he swatted that one way back. Cheese brewed, Frierson in the corner. 
Brisson to Sanders, a little running eight footers, good. Left of the lane, Sanders knocks down a little eight foot runner, and it's eight to three. Lebanon will have it in the back court. Official, not very athletic, is he? No, he might kill himself. He almost killed himself, <laughs> getting the net loose from the rim. Vaughn brings it down. Lob underneath to Davis. Split the double team and lost it. Sanders, or Lane, rather, comes up with it. Turnover, Lebanon. Lane will bring it down. Five-point Lebanon lead. Cheese brew for three. Won't go. Rebound, Malcolm Manier. And Sanders is on his arm, and that's two on Sanders in a hurry. Second team foul as well as Chris Sanders is the only Riverdale Warrior to pick up fouls here in the early going. That may be. Sanders may be their best guard, and he's going to have to sit down. And coming into the ball game now is Jake Owen. And I keep looking for Ted Montgomery, who played so well against us over there, and I haven't seen him. Down court, Clemens for three on the left wing. Won't go. Rebound, Manier. Fakes, goes back up. Got it. 10-3, Lebanon. 5-0-3 to play, opening period. In the back court. To the big guy, Osborne, who's back there now. Lane in trouble. Again, gets it to Osborne. 10 seconds. No, they're going to have to call a timeout to keep it from being 10 seconds. Riverdale will be charged with a timeout. Lebanon leads 10 to 3. We'll be back in 30. Riverdale has four Blue Devils have scored here in the early going. Five by Manier, two by Brent Clemens, Daniel Easterly, and Reese Davis has hit one of two from the charity strike. Riverdale will bring it down. In the ball game now is Marquise Crockett. He's out at the top of the key. And I beg your pardon, that was Adam Osborne. Number 21. That is Montgomery. That is Montgomery. And a bad pass. Here's Malcolm Manier, one on one. He lays it up no good, but he's fouled by Jake Owen. And Malcolm Manier will go to the free throw line and shoot a pair. Manier at the free throw line for the first time this evening. 10 10 3 lead has a chance to extend to a nine point Blue Devil. Manier gets number one and we'll have another. 11-3, eight point Lebanon lead. Manier can make it nine. Now here comes Marquise Crockett. About 6'4 and about 210, 215. Malcolm Manier at the throw line. Second of two, hit number one. Second throw is off no good. And Osborne, I think, was in too quick. At least that's what they will call. And Malcolm Manier will get to do it again. A freebie here for Malcolm Manier. Second throw is off, no good. Rebound, Cheese Brew, left side. Long feed. Here's Fearson. Blocked by Reese Davis. That was Marquise Crockett out behind there, out in front of everybody, and Davis blocked it. That's his second block tonight. Trying to go underneath the Easley, the Easterly, and Osborne had a hand in his back, shoving him out of the way, and Lebanon will have the basketball. That's four team fouls. And Bobby Leathers getting ready to come into the lineup, and Osborne will go out. They trade 6'8 six, for 6'6, six, six, but Leathers probably has more weight than Osborne. Boy, he's a big kid. Lebanon kicks it in bounds to Malcolm Manier out front to Vaughn. Vaughn around the top of the key to Clemens to Vaughn. Clemens on the left wing to Manier. Back to Clemens to Vaughn. Clemens, Manier out of the corner for three. Good. Manier cans a three out of the corner, and it's 14-3. Blue Devils. Kick it out to Bobby Leathers, and a steal by Manier. Malcolm Manier brings it down. Working in front, Manier with an 18-footer that's good. Riverdale wants time. Manier taking it over. 16 to 3. Lebanon will be back in 30. Five. Game or something. Well, Clyde, you really like the way they've come out of here. 16 to 3. With 3.33 to go in the first quarter. Malcolm Manier is, is playing the way that we've expected him to play all year long. He's he's hit two big threes and a, and a couple of nice athletic moves with the basket. Pull up jump shots, Clyde. And he's feeling tonight. He's playing defense. He's got three or four steals. And he's playing well for the Blue Devils right now. Leathers will make the inbounds toss. Does so to Cheese Brew. Cheese Brew in the backcourt. Gets it to Owen. Long feed near side. And here is Marquise Crockett. 
and a jumper underneath by Ted Montgomery, who got it down, and it's 16 to 5. Lanier with it on the right wing, kicks it out front to, to Vaughn. Vaughn sets it up, working against Owen. Vaughn going down the lane, kicks it off. Eight foot jumper by Reese Davis is good. Leathers to Cheese Brew. Kickoff pass, and here is a jam underneath by Crockett. Well, that brought the Riverdale crowd up, but that may turn the Blue Devils on here. Reese Davis working to Clemens on the left wing. Back out front to Vaughn. Vaughn back to Clemens. Lob underneath Reese Davis. And an 18-footer by Davis. It's no good. Easterly fights for and gets the rebound. Malcolm in here open from 18. Good. 20 to 7, Blue Devils. 13 now for Maneer, as he's already reached double digits in the first quarter. Here comes Cheese Brew, right side to Owens, down low to Leathers. Leathers, long cross court pass to Cheese Brew. They knock it free. It's picked up by Owens in the far corner. They go down low to Leathers, and he's going to be fouled by Easterly, and that's two on Easterly. Bobby Leathers will go to the free throw line and shoot two. It's only the second team foul against the Blue Devils as Easterly has both of them, Clyde. They'll send big Bobby Leathers to the free throw line. Well, Heatherless is Leathers is some kind of guy. About 6'6 six, six and what 240, something like that, maybe more. John. Easterly out, boys in. Lannon coming into the ball game, and Clemens will sit down. And Bobby Leathers will have two shots. Leathers toes the mark and guns number one and hits. No, he missed the first well, one. He that missed the, the first one, sir. You're right. That was the second one. So it's a 20 to 8 ball game. 11 by a dozen. Vaughn down the lane to Boyce. Fakes, puts it up and in. Nice feed by Boyce there. Double fake. Leathers almost got the foul. Down court. They go to Montgomery in the corner with a 15-footer that's off no good. It's out of bounds. It'll belong to Riverdale underneath. Off the hands of Lebanon, Ted Montgomery will make the inbounds pass play. Sanders coming back into the ball game, and Owens will check out. With a minute 44. Montgomery on the baseline. They get it to Crockett. And it's slapped out of there by Davis, but somebody got him on the arm first. I believe they called on Matt Vaughn, 31, his first personal. Well, Reese Davis is just not letting anything go to the basket tonight if he has anything to say about There's it. There's nobody on this floor can jump with Reese Davis. Inbounds play. He's only in this gym that And there's another one. Red Davis up a mile to block it again. Marquise Crockett, he got him on the arm that time. Well, wow, that first block three blocks like already by Davis and another that was canceled out. And Crockett will go to the free throw line and shoot one and one, or maybe two. I guess they'll give him two here. Crockett at the free throw line. Number one is on the way and good. High arch and shot drops it through. Osborne coming back in, leathers out. Marquise Crockett. And you get the feeling that the Riverdale coach trying to play the numbers game to keep up with Lebanon. Free throw off, no good. Vaughn had it, and Crockett is over his back. Crockett trying to follow his shot. Matt Vaughn already had it. And Crockett ran over him. Riverdale going to put a little full court pressure on here. Landon with it down the left side to Vaughn. Vaughn in the corner. They and say Reese Davis stepped on the baseline. They say trying to drive around the Riverdale player over there. 22 to 9, Lebanon with a minute 17 to play in the opening period. Frierson back into the lineup replacing Crockett. 